and we're in the catastrophe that we're in right now, didn't I just address you in that? No one else? You did you did address me, yes. And that's but right. I think I think that a lot of people took it as you were addressing them as well because they were in the video. But I only talked about you. As far as smashing me down, yes. It was just me that you were talking about. Yes. Well not smashing you down. And I, and, I, and I tell them that too. All right. I just wanted your clarification because yeah. you wouldn't know more than anybody else. I don't, I don't know anything about this, the whole Sasquatch thing, dude. Don't even know. Don't even know. I assume they were talking about the gorilla dude on Aaron B. Cox's channel that plays the <laughs> instruments and shit. Yeah, the, the no saxophone. That's what I thought. That's what I thought. Well, it was just always interesting why they came to me. It's not what you think. You can never explain that part of what they thought it really was. Never really explained what it really was. I mean, these are people you hang with. I'm not putting you as responsible for what they say. Of course not. That's ridiculous. But at the same token, you do know that. Yeah, I know them very well. Mm -hmm. That's it. So if you really had something else to tell me, because my well, fight is not with you, I'm just getting the truth out there of how this happened. Okay, well, then let's clarify the my hair being crazy. I thought that was a picture that you and I were laughing about, and then all of a sudden, two months later, this picks up again, and now I'm imitating an afro? Come well, on, it was man. always like that in my head. It was always like that. Then why don't you just come out and tell me that? We it were laughing so about it for how long? It is funny. It is funny. Dude, I got naturally curly hair. My hair is fucked, and it's fucked up. I should show you my high school pictures. We talk about an afro, they couldn't even fit the fucker in the, in the yearbook. <laughs> My head's almost cut off from it. I'm not imitating an afro, man. You are. Look at, look at the part of the video, because you turn your cam on at that point when they're talking about the Sasquatch. To be goofy, to be funny? Yeah. Your eyes Same didn't... Thing. <laughs> okay, no. My eyes what? It didn't look, it looked like you were as high as stuff because you went off camera at that point. I was sitting in my office at work. I wasn't high. <laughs> I wish I could get high again. Life was much easier back then. So. Mm -hmm. I got to with that. But this guy, yeah. this, this yeah, other funny, dark you right, right, you kicked him out you of King's New York. He was in there arguing with me. I'm going to use the fucking you get up at San Diego. I have no idea. I mean, fuck, everybody knows when you lie no down, you my ladder's going to click and stuff like that. You're going to slip out the fucking head. And, Come on, uh, right, right. Was uh -huh. arguing back and forth. I'm here to represent you. Dude, I don't know who you are. You don't represent me. Fuck. Yeah, just like it's people some, think I'm in God. Fuck, I'm just me. And cloning accounts to get a dude, rise out of people. YouTube's just a, a fucking entertainment, man. Platform. Come on. Well, my hobby, obviously, man. uh... I got some like bumpy information. Funny. I didn't really think he was you. Way to pass time on me. Typing in there. But the no, and, and, and I really haven't, man. I've been, I've, been, I've been respectful. I've been just listening to what you've had to say, and I didn't want to start typing in your room or leaving comments or anything like that. Of course, I'm going to listen. My name's uh, being well, brought up and shit, you know? Yeah, well, the, the story is, and you happen to be a part of it. So, so am I. So, that's how that works, man. Mm -hmm. like, it just goes far, and if people have questions, and people say, I started a whole bunch of stuff with a whole bunch of people, and that's not true. I mean, it wasn't like they were just innocent, and yeah, I did have questions like a normal an person would if they yeah. thought something. And I didn't know you well enough to be like, oh, well, let's go on private. I just don't believe in that. You don't have to do that no, to me. Right. No, I'm, I'm saying, and I jumped up on that live stream with you and talked to you about certain things. Mm -hmm. You know, you, just like, you have I'm to not, realize not. My, I'm not holding you I'm really responsible new. for APM in her delusions, no. you know? No, no. I'm holding and her responsible and Mike Truth, too. Yeah, I see him in the chat room talking about me running illegal child rings and shit. Come on, man. It's, it's no, ridiculous. Yeah, when it comes to that point, well, the thing is, we both oh, yeah. have had accusations. It's just like, like some that. troll tries to just say, uh, say I got so many felonies and that this long oh, rap sheet for years. Yeah. And evictions. I know, like that. I, I know. Record, grooming, you told me the story. Girls and shit. It's crazy. Yeah. 
Uh, people call me just fucking creepy, point, man, sicko, Sam. I don't even know what to say. Rumor, I'm a sex offender. I'm a pedophile. Well, your your girlfriend is even doing that. She's accusing me of working with Thomas. I mean, I'm fucking grown man. Yeah, I want you to look at some woman and say they're good looking. Like so what? Figures. Does that make me a pervert? Does it make me a pedophile? Does that make me sex offender? The only time I ever even heard the name brought up was usually by niece by Aaron. That's how I even heard the name before. Oh, Denise likes to bring up every fucking person's mm -hmm. name. She's always talking about Aaron and Sugar Shine and, and you know Dave Anton and Thomas Lohmer. Uh, it, you know, who knows? I don't know what this dude does. All she's always bring up other people's musician. names, like left and right. And one minute she couldn't stand him. He was the terrorist running all these rings. And then all of a sudden, out of nowhere, she had a change of heart. And all of a sudden, she's defending him and stuff. And I never took the time to look into it. Because to me, it just seemed like another... Roller coaster of crap, you know. So mm. interesting is that those two that bring this guy up. I'm trying to get down to the bottom of this Denise and this Aaron D. Cox stuff. He's been right, reading some really interesting stuff, and it just like I have these feelings about those two. Okay. Well, and I'll be honest with you too on that one too. It's like one minute Aaron's extremely like i don't know cool to me or whatever and then next thing you know he's running shit on me and so no i don't dude i'm in the same boat you are as far as trusting people go so, no, you know, sure. I've, I've known aaron since 2016 when i first jumped on and or maybe set early 2017 or whatever and uh it's a, there's always been a um a beef with somebody with him always and, and to me, when that happens, when somebody is constantly beefing with different people all the time, all over the place, I mean, and, and then and then to sit and be like, oh, everybody's attacking me. Well, if you step in shit, you're going to get your shoes full of shit. It's kind of how I'm looking at it, you know? So, like, for example, if you and I start going at it, you know, I can be upset with you you can be upset with me but truthfully we put ourselves in that position so we can't both sit here and be like oh they're they're targeting me like and then you know no if i choose to get involved with something and speak my mind there's going to be repercussions to that i understand that mm -hmm. yeah no, i expected a response i wanted a, a response that's what i wanted but the response that i got was not from who i was asking about so it was always troubling when people like said oh yeah well he came in and attacked us no nah, that's not how it went you know, i'm just saying you gotta take responsibility you're not I, you, and, you can and respond I'm whatever you want you know right, well, just to, you for you. right and i think the first time you and i ever even talked was on mike truth's channel yeah we we're talking about satanism and yeah stuff like that yeah right i remember yep and so from that point on i started watching your videos and stuff and i'm like Man, this guy puts out some pretty interesting content you know when it comes to like tupac and all that stuff interesting mm -hmm. stuff you think outside of the box and i appreciate that i i do and i do think your content is good in that stuff but when it, now it's starting to get like and i'm not just saying you it's like it's everybody in this little war that's going on right now you know, everybody has something to say and everybody's upset about something and it's really not getting any of us anywhere, is what I'm saying. It's just oh, back and no. forth, back and forth, and, you know, <laughs> I mean, when it, I you know, and I'm not Frankie actually going to say anything Oh, China, really about duh. <laughs> be blonde before she's saying I had like, a Monty video like a week after Frankie came out. If I want to talk to somebody out. personally, then I will wait till I can talk to them personally. But if anybody's got any kind of information that people are doing illegal shit with kids, shouldn't be talking about it on YouTube. They should be throwing their asses in jail. Yeah, she's calling the cops and the yeah. FBI. Well, to my talk shit on the internet. has never been about that. A YouTube stream. My thing has always been about just interesting things. That I see. Just like some of these people saying they got to fucking pocket information. You know, people grooming kids. What I'm talking, and talking and about is the way people are conducting and this channel. Who's a vice trolling? Who's shilling? giving examples of what to look for that's it i'm not trying to bust <laughs> so is it how can you tell if you is here we are all we are all banned <laughs> <laughs> got that right and now they're not here no more 
Nobody's getting mad. Right. Right. I got a. Do you know why she's not here? She's getting her beauty sleep. Like about being timed out of One of her kids is doing it. Oh, that's years. right. They're probably night running night around the backyard playing yeah. dirt right now. Yeah, and I wasn't there to see that. And I mean, and that you know what? It 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 applies to like anybody that's got a channel. If somebody's a mod. And you give them that privilege to be a mod, and they tell people to get out of here, then then get out of there. Mm. You know, I mean, I'm not gonna, mm. I'm not gonna go to somebody's house and and uh, walk in and start being an asshole and expect that people are gonna welcome me with open arms. But that's what I was exactly. explaining, though. Like uh, I've been it's like doing you go to somebody's, pro somebody's property and they don't want you, and they tell you to get out, they get off the property, and leave. You so go. You really think you're, you know, you don't, if you don't saying, leave, you, you, you tell the senior, like, "Well, I feel like but no." Guess what? They're going to call the cops. Guess what's going to happen? You're going like to you 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 you're gonna receive a PPA. You're going to be fucking. You're going to be trespassed. I'm watching it go by. You haven't been. You're not in my shoes and my predicament. And I know it sounds like a cop out to not understand what I'm saying, but that's not the case. I'm just saying that you have to really look at it through my lens to see what I'm saying about this stuff. These people have been trying and to it's, set me up to things. Right. And, and, and it's... I know you've told I mean, me before, you've had, like, you Facebook like, docs you know, years ago. and all that kind of stuff. No, you went to a raw seal, you went to check a license. People are getting hold of family and You walked like around the house with a refrigerator and got not, a can of Pepsi. That shit's not cool. That shit happened to me, and too. He, and he said, so well, I went to the house and got Pepsi, but I paid for it like that. And he got pissed like, dude, you don't walk in our house. Your are is in the yard. Here's another house. You don't walk in there to help yourself to the fridge. You want to go to the store, not to the house. Yeah, posted that one Yeah, they got to run the kids to get off the property. That's the stupidest move you can do. I told him. Most likely, but I can't remember what your okay. test is making was. So back when, when I made this video, again, there was a few YouTubers that were putting out information like the same stuff that APM is doing right now. Saying, I'm, you know, that I'm a kitty diddler and all this shit. I'm a Chester, whatever. It seems like whenever somebody gets pissed off at somebody on YouTube, that's where they go with the pedophile shit. Yep, right exactly, away. Mike. And exactly. So what I did is I thought, okay, they're calling me like yeah. this devil worshiper. Had, you know, and, yeah, I thought I told you that they don't like the words that come out. Them. They don't like the videos I draw or they get pissed off me. For so that's what they bring up. They say I'm a pedophile, I'm a child molester, you know I'm Let's a sex offender. Like fell on the talking about saying, I have, a, I have felony records for a sexual harassment and molesting women and little girls and shit. I literally just ran my fingers on the keyboard. A whole bunch of blah shit. I like that. APM watching the channel, all you see is Message deleted. Message deleted. Message deleted. Yep. Reverse psychology to beat them. People get timed thing. out left and right. Bam. Just how stupid uh, it was. And I had. A, I did a video. I showed it was. A couple weeks ago, I showed. I showed nothing but message deleted. I guess that explains it then. I didn't know. But to the naked eye, to the naked eye, yeah. From to the naked eye of those that are on the outside looking in and didn't know what was going on, I can see where that video would be like. Uh, wait a minute. Something's up with this guy. What's going on with this cat? Yeah. I understand that. Yeah. Well, that, that was, was the whole point. That was the whole point, yeah. you know? So you can't, you can't blame me for talking about that. There. That's why I'm explaining it to you. Right. That's why I'm talking to you about it now and explaining it to you. Because obviously you didn't know what was going on back then. I had an idea from Mike Truth's channel what was going on, but in terms of yeah, personal... Yeah, he actually wasn't mm -hmm. one of the ones. Actually, I, I found... Replying to Mike Truth is like it's just it's not even it's not even worth it. You can't have a decent conversation with that guy. I've tried before. So it's weird. I don't know how I can have a decent conversation with him. Fuck, it's hard to have a decent I, conversation I with that either. guy. Uh, I yeah, I don't know. I mean, maybe your tolerance for him is better than mine. I don't know. Uh, probably. Well, then again, you I don't comment a lot. Yeah. Well, it's hard for a person to tolerate my so, truth because he goes, he gets uh, scatterbrained. He know, starts, but I just, he I'm starts the his own propaganda like bullshit, like his Sandy Hook, his TikTok, and all this shit. And you, you, know, think you have to look at Mikey like, what the, the fuck are you talking about, my truth? Like, I was literally making fun of Kim for not liking a food product. Because I thought, this America, everybody eats cheese. Yeah. Just like my fiance doesn't eat mustard ketchup. Well, then like, like I said, and, uh, I said before, you know, I think the reason why Kim doesn't like much cheese because she's you know, lactose right. intolerant. Well, she doesn't well, like much dairy products. Yeah, the master question. My hand's uh, boyfriend is. Okay. is that way, too. He can't have much dairy products as well. He has to get one of those lactose intolerant kind of milk like that. They do make that. If you drink regular milk, he'll start breaking out. It's true. I didn't know about these codes 
So I looked up yeah. on Google on that live stream. Like people talking about, we're yeah. talking code, Pizza like we're, we're talking code, code and words music and food. Google. And it popped up. And I said, if you click the link, these are the names you're going to, you know, these are the words you're going to see. And when it came to the, oh no, how am I ever going to pay for it? That is two different streams that I actually have, Urban. It wasn't one, it wasn't one sentence. <laughs> Man, you are just completely discredited at this point. Really? Yeah. Because 